What's happening guys, it's Dan from General Tech HQ here and in today's video I'll be reviewing a product from Zero Lemon which they have sent me. This is the Slim Fit iPhone 6 battery case and it's been something that I've been trying to get my hands on for a long time because let's be honest, all iPhone's battery is just rubbish. You know, we like to keep it real in these videos and I don't work for Apple, I don't, <laughs> I don't need to promote anything. It is midday right now and my phone is on 29%. That is just not good enough. That's not going to last me till the end of the day, which is why a battery case is a really great accessory. And the thing is, in the past, I have done reviews on external batteries, which have to have a cable for and a USB. What's great about a battery case is it's just there on your iPhone. It doesn't really add much extra bulk. Uh, some of them actually look really good, just like this one, and provide protection. So we're going to unbox this, take a look around at the specifications and the details of it. But yeah, let's get into unboxing the iPhone 6 battery case from Zero Lemon. I hope you enjoy. So anyway, let's take a look at what is inside the box. But first off, let's just quickly look at the front. You can see this is the battery case for the iPhone 6, as it says. As you can see, it actually comes in two battery size configurations, 3,100 mAh and 2,400 mAh. This model, as you can see with, by the red sticker, is the 3,100 mAh version. So anyway, let's take the sleeve off this bad boy and you are left with this nice brown box with the Zero Lemon logo on it. If you open that up, just like so, you are straight away opened up to a one year warranty card from Zero Lemon. And this basically means that if any defects occur with this product, you have a one year warranty on it, but they're unlikely to occur, of course. And then you have the actual charging case itself, which of course we will look at in more detail in just a second. And you've got a bit of plastic that sits in there. And right here is actually a earphone adapter, which you'll see why that comes in handy in the later part of the video. Take the plastic off. Right here you have the micro USB charger. This is actually used for charging the case itself, because of course that needs to be charged. And then of course you get an instruction manual, and that is it. So anyway, let's move all of this stuff out of the way and look at this case itself and how to put it on your iPhone 6. So first off, you're gonna to wanna to get your iPhone 6 out, then you're gonna to wanna to actually separate the case into the two parts that it comes in. Now actually, when you're looking at it right now, you can see it's a full-bodied kind of product, and that's what it's like when it's on your phone, but you are actually meant to take it apart like that to actually put your phone inside. It's very, very simple. And you'll see why now, because obviously you need to slide the phone onto that lightning connector. So let's do that right now, very simple slides in like that, you can feel it click in there. Then you're gonna to wanna to put this sort of frame back on, clip it in and you'll be able to hear those clicking noises so you can know when it's on. And there you go. So anyway, let's actually have a look around the case now. And just for a minute, let's just forget that it has a battery inside it and look at it as a normal case. So as you can see, it is in the black color, which I really like, does look good with any of the color iPhones white, gold, and black. So starting on the back, you can see you've got a Zero Lemon logo right there. You've got a power button, which will actually power the battery here. Then got four lights at the bottom there, which represent how much power this battery actually has itself, not the phone. Then you have a cutout here for the camera, flash, and the microphone that is in the back there. At the front, you actually have two new speaker holes, which is where the volume, or sorry, the noise is coming out of your iPhone now. It's not gonna come from the bottom, because of course the bottom is now completely sealed up. All you've got access to is that earphone jack where you can use your adapter that the case actually comes with. On the side, you have your mute and silent switch open to use the actual real one. However, the volume flickers are actually added onto the case and then they then press the real volume control on the phone. You then, of course, have access to the power button on the side, nothing up top. And yeah, it's a really sturdy case and I'd be confident if you dropped this from anywhere on its side or back, you would save it. So now actually onto the function of this case, which is to charge your phone. This is its USP, this is why you've bought it for $50, which is what it will cost you. And what you do is, is you press here and hold, and you just saw there, it is now charging my phone. So what you're actually seeing on the back there when you turn it on, I don't know if you saw that light at the back, 
we turn it back on, you can see it's got one light. That shows that it's on about 25% battery because it's got four lights. When the all four lights are lit up, it means it's fully charged, the case itself. So anyway, if I had this case fully charged right now, it could actually charge my phone up to 120%. So just to put that in sort of real terms, if this phone was on 0%, it could charge it to 100%, and then it could go down to 80, and I could charge it to 100 again, which is really, really impressive, and that's really ample energy for what you need for a whole day out, for example. Anyway guys, that was a review on the iPhone 6 charging case from Zero Lemon. I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you have, remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe here at General Tech HQ for lots more tech videos coming up very, very soon. And do check out the link in the description if you want to see the link to this particular product and Zero Lemon's website. Anyway guys, I hope you have a brilliant rest of the day and I'll catch you later.